Yeah, I've been taking time lapse on those gold fingers in solution there with this little guy <laughs> for a couple hours. But I ain't hardly, it's barely even bubbling. <laughs> it's floored. It's a hall of heat, a full blast. Well, folks, this guy is tough. <laughs> it's coming. Been about an hour here or more. Me a lot more room. That's a thousand. This guy here is two thousand. So let me clean this guy up here. I'll bring it back here and we'll get on it here again. Gently pour it here. This dude is like super full, right? Let's so do that for a little bit. Exactly how I left it. Ooh, we got a lot of gold in the bottom of that one. Some more of those gold fingers that I was working on. And I bought a little over 200 bucks for them. So like I said, I'm hoping to get three, three plus grams. <laughs> I'm like, I've been losing money. Whatever. This stuff usually costs me money. It doesn't usually make me money, but it's fun to do. It's like fishing. You typically don't make much money. But it's a lot of fun to do. This guy here looks pretty sweet there. I'll inspect that in a few minutes here. See if that's got to be ran again. Or if I can just start pulling out the pieces, you know. Which would be pretty fast. Okay. Yeah. Uh, one and three quarter cup. Yeah, you know what I found uh, with these little catch plates that I have? Uh, these guys are by far tougher than like the clear Pyrex. Yeah, over the years I've had... Uh, these guys here, I haven't had any failures, this type of material, but like these guys, oh my gosh, yeah, these guys here, even though they're Pyrex, right, uh, on a real cold day, uh, not too long ago, just a couple weeks ago, I had this, uh, one of these sitting on this guy, and I was spinning some material, like this one's supposed to be spinning, come on now. Get on up there. Kind of just like that. Full blast heat. Spinning some material. It didn't have hardly any in there though, right? And I got busy doing something else and I forgot about it. And I left it go about an hour longer than I should have. And it totally evaporated. Okay. Down to just almost nothing. It was cold that day. And uh, I come out here. And one of these things, uh, similar to this one, was completely shattered. All over the place. This thing was standing straight up, right on the hot plate, still running. <laughs> and it didn't break that. It just broke this thing. So, yeah, I cleaned up all the glass everywhere, and it was all in here everywhere. And yeah, but these things are uh, well, pretty good, and they're fine for this kind of stuff. You know, for putting things, you want to put something in the sun for a while, or you're playing around with something over here, you can... Use them for a nice catch plate, so if something happens and you break something or spill it, you got the material. But yeah, this kind of material, like these little corals, same kind of stuff, I think, as uh, this white material. Like these guys. I've had a couple of these guys break because they're not uh, that good of tempered glass. Uh, so, yeah, just for point of reference, if you ever do this and you need uh, some you know, catch plates, because you really do, you put that straight on the burner uh, sooner or later it's gonna break you may get lucky 10 hundred times who knows but it's gonna break and you're gonna have acid everywhere and gold and blah 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 whatever you're doing it won't be good so yeah use a catch plate I recommend these old ones uh, that's this white cor uh, corning wear they are tough now I haven't seen any of those break uh, maybe you know Maybe you've seen different. <laughs> if you have, let me know because uh, those things are terrific. You know, you pay 10, 20 bucks for one on uh, eBay or find a garage sale for 10 bucks or whatever. Yeah, they last, man. They last, last, last. They're tough. 
Yeah, some of these dudes look pretty good here, so I'm snatching a couple of them out to inspect. What we got that one's free and almost perfectly clean, hey? Eh? Usually hit them with a tiny bit of water anyway because I don't want any acid on them really. It's got one little piece there, but let me put on my other specs because I can't see well enough with my safety glasses to know if. There's a hunk of gold or not on there. Not, oh, there's one right there. There it goes. That's just little pieces of copper. All right, nice. Let them go in the trash. The trash can straight on down there. That's right, there's a little piece of gold on that one. Okay, hey, Mr. Beth, we got this little guy over here. Right hey, here, this guy's doing time lapse. So, I'm trying to get an interesting one going here for us. <laughs> so, uh, let me get some uh, sodium metabisulfate. We'll put it in a scoop and see what happens. Yeah, I rinsed the majority of the uh, gold already off down there, as you can see. Oh yeah, baby. I'm hoping there's a smidge more than three grams. Just 3.2, yeah, I probably broke even. So, anyway, I like doing it, so it really don't matter too much. So, just like any other hobby, sometimes they cost money. Anyway, it's it looks like pretty good stuff. It's got quite a bit of debris in there still. You can see a little green parts, which is the uh, coating on the PCBs. But that's okay, I'll come right off. <laughs> Everything comes off at 2,000 degrees. <laughs> All right, peace, baby. Okay, I'm going to see something here. See if uh, I can get a sense. Oh, well, there's a little piece of debris in there, right? piece of circuit board. It was hiding amongst the piles. Let's see if I can get a feel for what I got here. Just looking at it thinking, hmm, I'm hoping there's three grams. But, I've done this a few times, so <laughs> I have some basis of reference. Yeah, just, I think, uh, I think about three grams, maybe three and a half, maybe four. Oop, damn, that's no good. <laughs> Sling gold all over the place. Ah, oh, yeah. I slung it like nobody's business. <laughs> gold finger. <laughs> James Bond would be proud. <laughs> okay, fine. Don't touch it. Don't touch it no more, Matt. <laughs> yeah, it sticks to your finger pretty well. All right. Golden piece. Ooh, we'll do a golden piece. Yeah, that's right. Golden piece. Golden piece, yeah. We need peace. Something se severe. Golden piece, baby. <laughs> you have a little water in there. You can get a sense of uh, how light these things are, right? 
Anyway, hopefully four grams late. <laughs> All right, I'm done playing with it. I'm done, I'm done, I'm done, I'm done. Okay, folks, you can see I got that, uh, that gold. I put it in this beaker. I got a stir bar in there with just a smidge of uh, water. And uh, so you can see it spinning. And well, like I said, I'm hoping we're three grams. <laughs> I got a little bit of hydrochloric here I'm going to add. Yeah, that's a plenty right there. Yeah, hydrochloric won't uh, put those uh, foils into solution at all. But uh, when I hit it with nitric, it sure will. I got very little material in there as far as uh, uh, liquid goes, all right? Little tiny bit of water. There's about 100 milliliters total of uh, hydrochloric and water. Yeah, folks, I switched out that entire beaker. This beaker here I was headed in. I put it in this littler one because uh, it just, uh, I'd have to use a gigantic catch plate like that big white one. <laughs> and it takes a lot of heat to get that up. And I, I'm just, I'm running here, baby. We ain't waiting for nothing. So again, I got it stirring. Hydrochloric. A little bit of water. Yeah. He's moving away there. Looks pretty good. Let's get, uh, the nitric involved here give it just a small shot this stuff won't take much because it's just these little thin foils right that's probably enough that's probably about i don't know five maybe ten milliliters at the very most at the very most cap this dude off there's all oh, there it is i knew it was here somewhere oh. and we got a little bit of gold right there what are you doing get on in there Man up here, come on. All right, oh no, you little bugger. <laughs> ah, it's playing hard to get, get on. Oh, there it goes, okay. I got it in there anyway. All right, cap it off. There's a couple more pieces stuck to the side there, which yeah, I can rinse them down. Yeah, there we go, not too bad. Okay, you can see that solution already turning yellow and of course it'll get a nice deep golden color as it goes into solution you get your golden solution I'll spin it very fast just a little bit in the middle there it goes a little bit more than that oh, look at that oh baby it's gonna be pretty anyway yeah i got the heat up full blast stir bar just barely spinning it's pretty cold out here i don't have even a sweatshirt on or anything but uh yeah it's brisk nice and brisk wakes me up <laughs> keeps my brain functioning All right. well, folks you can see that uh most of those foils are in solution there's a little bit of debris, you know, the green stuff floating around, which is part of the uh, circuit board. Some polymer that won't disintegrate in aqua regia. <laughs> anyway, yeah, it's almost good already, but I'm gonna still bring it up, uh, you know, much hotter than that. I'm gonna bring it to a boil and uh, try to burn off some of the nitric too. And then, uh, yeah, we'll deal with it. I might have to denox it on the heat, I don't know. But as we go, we learn a little bit more and we just keep chugging along, baby. This is the remainder of that, uh, those fingers. Can't really see them, but yeah, there's a little tiny bit of uh, gold in there off the same batch. You know, probably about, I don't know, maybe a hundredth of a gram. <laughs> Not much. Almost nothing. So anyway, dang, that's it. That's it for right this second. That's it for right this second. Okay, fine. That's it for right this second. Yeah, I'm bouncing back and forth constantly between the solar and that. And you. <laughs> and you guys. And you guys. And you guys. And you, 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 you guys. You guys. You guys. Don't get me. Don't get me. Don't get me. Don't get me. Don't get me, you bad thing. <laughs> okay, that's it. You guys are wild animals. We love them so much. Without them, I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, be careful. Josie Wales is a crazy person, right? She'll bite the H out of you. For sure. 
yeah that gold solution there uh looks pretty good i've uh turned it off uh and uh it's been cooling for it's not even lukewarm it's just slightly cold to the touch it's been cooling for uh maybe an hour or something something like that and it's cool out here with a strong not a real heavy breeze but a bit of a breeze anyway i'm gonna run that dude through this filter setup hey i'm gonna filter this dude right now right now wet my filter a little bit here like that bring the top off here Goes. I'm going to slow it first because I don't want to get all that garbage in there uh, until I got all the clear liquid, you know, without debris in it, basically filtered. of the junk but I'm gonna still save that filter because it might have a couple microbes of gold in there a couple years from now you'd be saying oh I wish I had a gram of gold oh my filters my three million zillion filters <laughs> I spray this out a little bit too in here and I know it just makes it a messy wet mess in there but we're in Idaho only about five percent humidity <laughs> Or later, should be dry. Well, there we go. Thanks, baby. Hey, folks. I think I've got this thing under control here a little bit. I heated it up a little bit uh, to, uh, you know, ensure I didn't have any nitric in it. And I shouldn't have any, so this should look pretty good, I hope. Let's see. Let me get this junk out of the way so we can get a a good visual observation of the whole of the whole situation. All right, so I'll put on a little scoop here. To start. Let's see what happens. Oh my gosh! Look at it go. It's the tiniest of bit there. Maybe a tenth of a teaspoon. Almost no change. Tiny bit darker. Oh, there's the gold. Put it ripping out of there. Nah, it's not enough though. It's like, yeah, ain't enough. Okay, here goes a pretty good scoop. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh man, yeah, she's cutting down like, like nobody's business now. Let's try the rest of this teaspoon. Mighty fine, mighty fine. I said mighty fine. Mm-hmm. All right, I'm gonna try a smidge more here. About another quarter teaspoon. We almost got our white foam on top, so let's try to smidge more. Yeah, that's the familiar stuff. Yep, she's done. She's done, guys. Okay, I'm gonna let her sit here and figure itself up. What? What?
what? Your all time lapse out? Would you pass out? I think it's done. Yeah, I think it's done done. I hope I caught the whole thing clearing up because it looks pretty new, huh? There's like Mount Gold there on the bottom. Try not to stir it up too much here. I don't want to stir it on up on you. Yeah. Yeah, I can see it's that nice brown, beautiful gold. Brown, beautiful gold. Doesn't look like very much, so. Yeah, it's starting to make me twitch. <laughs> Let's see what's on in here. Okay, I'll be back. It's baby. Okay, folks, here's the moment of truth. All of our work on those PCBs, or on the, uh, not the PCBs, but the gold fingers. It's pretty juicy. Let's give it a shot at the title, see what it's got here. beautiful anyway hopefully there's enough or I don't lose too much money <laughs> oh. okay let me thump this container <laughs> there's more in here oh we got just a smidge over three grams okay fine fine yeah probably lost 20 or 30 bucks but whatever that's beautiful gold anyway whatever it's beautiful uh-huh yeah, I got a brand new test here to show you though. This is my new test. <laughs> bring this gold, let me bring this gold on in the shed here for a second. Everything's out of control like normal because I got so much junk going on. But uh, we're doing good. We're, one day we'll get it all under control once I'm dead and gone. <laughs> okay, now this here is a reference. Uh huh, that right there. That's sweet tips gold there, baby. Woohoo! <laughs> yeah. Five times refined. So yeah, super beautiful. Now, I'd say we're pretty close, baby. Not perfect, but I'll tell you what, it's it's pretty close. All right? <laughs> okay. I'm happy about that. Alright, it worked out. It worked out. Peace, baby.